Well, in just about a week, Ohio voters will go to the polls to have their final say on issue two, which would legalize the recreational use of marijuana. So if issue two passes, Ohio would become the 25th state to legalize cannabis. Now, next Tuesday's election is being watched nationally, we should point out. It says a test of conservative values in a Republican-leaning state. So to help dive into this issue and the politics that are behind it, because there are always politics behind it, Mark Nam uh, Namick, managing editor of Signal Cleveland, is with us now. What stands out to you, Mark? What are some of the, the main questions people have at this time? Well, the first and biggest thing that issue two is going to do, it's going to allow you to smoke weed. Yeah. You know, right now people forget that under medical marijuana right now, edibles, oils, even vaping is legal, but you can't light anything up. Mm. Also, another big change, and that is, you're gonna be able to carry it, uh, possess it. Uh, right now, people are, you know, can get uh, criminal charges against them for carrying it uh, up to uh, a Ziploc baggy side. I know back in the 70s, people would try to sell you that, the old dime bag, but uh, there'll be, a, some of that's legal. You can also now, if it passes, grow your own plants. Can't be selling them but you would uh, have to buy your marijuana specifically from dispensaries by showing your ID just like you do alcohol. Okay. okay. So I, I know there hasn't been a lot of attention given to the issue of people who say are already facing marijuana charges. So if this passes, does it change anything for them? No, and that is a big issue. So if you were facing criminal charges for possession mm -hmm. for the very same amount that's soon to be legal, nothing changes. You are still prosecuted under the old law that is an issue that kind of drove uh, some of the activists to get signatures to push this, was the idea that, you know what, too many people are getting hit with this, it's tripping them up for jobs and other things, we wanna make this legal, uh, but right now it does not do anything for those currently facing charges. So how, how is the issue doing in the polls? I mean, I do know law enforcement agencies have already come out, you know, against issue two. How's it doing? In and, and so have doctors, okay. family groups and businesses have really been pushing mm -hmm. against it because they're fearful uh, that employees would show up high or this would make uh, the job application process more difficult. And there are studies that make that debatable in some of the other states. There hasn't been a ton of polling, but it, it has been passing, but doing uh, not by as much as issue one, which is the abortion issue, which seems to uh, most people seem to be solidly have a strong opinion on that one way or the other, but leading uh, issue two is kind of quiet right now. Hmm. Hmm. All right. Well, we'll see how it goes. And I know that we're going to be depending on you as we move forward with election night. Thank you so much. See you then. Appreciate Thanks, it. Mark.